Hello LEGO fans, nice to see you again. Today you will see the next episode of my The Black Serpent Mock. This is the sixth episode of this series. The end is very near. Thank you for watching my progress and commenting on the project. I'll tell you about the details in a moment. What is The Black Serpent? It is a name of my project that came up with some time ago. I bought a couple of the Black Falcons minifigures and I thought it might be worth the building something. As you know, I really like building vehicles. I've been building Star Wars vehicles for a long time. I decided to build a medieval ship. Later I thought of some piece of land. And that's how it started. If you are here for the first time, I encourage you to watch the previous episodes. There have been several episodes, in each of them you will find interesting information. You will also be able to see some tutorials for trees, boats, leather and the mantlet. In the second episode I showed a review of my ship. It consists 1054 parts and can fit 15 minifigures on board. For this project I made my first custom style. PDF instruction is available, check the description of this movie for more details. This project is also available on replicable.com. In the previous episode you saw the first fragment of my castle. I showed the wall and the gate, with working harrow. In this episode you will see another fragment of my castle, the tower. I will show you how it's built and what techniques I used. You will also see the medieval house. I also didn't forget about the details. And finally there will be another tutorial for such little medieval card. This is the first episode where I want to show you the breaking orders. This means that the end of construction is very close. I already have most of parts I need. I may need one or two more small orders, but we will see. Today I will focus on the castle base plate. The area with the water and the coast is unchanged. I will add the details and more plants at the end. You will see my army of the Black Falcons. There are 20 here. I decided to order another 10 but I have to wait about two weeks for delivery. I think you'll be impressed by such a large army. It is a castle siege, after all. Now, very important thing. I managed to get sheep. I only have two. Maybe I'll buy a few more. They will appear somewhere on my diorama. I'll think where. Do you have any sheep in your collection? If not, I highly recommend them. I love them. Time to discuss the biggest base plate with the castle. In the previous episode I showed you the first fragment, the wall and the gate. Today you will see the first fragment of the hexagonal tower and how I built it. Building such a tower is a quite challenge. I had to work out the right connections to make the wall thing strong enough. The walls connect to each other in this way, by this plate with bar and these rounded plates. I use this connection every 10 bricks in height. The two opposite walls are connected to each other by bricks or plates 12 studs. It also needs a lot of slopes 2x1 to, to build the tower. There will be almost 200 of them. The tower is not ready yet. It will be much higher. I will add windows and doors on the walls. There will be the Raven Knight's flag on the top. Let's move behind the walls. I built a medieval house. It's not very advanced design, but it does the job. The house is slight angle, which required tiled ground. I had to use parts from medieval blacksmith set. 
I just added more black tiles on the roof. The house can be detached from the ground. Let's see how it looks. On the one side we have a chimney and a door to the house. I have not built an interior here. There are a lot of windows and details on the wall. I built the roof with nexto shields. A few tiles fell off. On the one side we can open the roof. And we have little surprise here, a ghost. There are also a lot of details next to the house. There is a table here, a pumpkin and some old wheel. On the other side we have a weapon rack and a blacksmith who sharpens sword. I've also added some plants here. Time to talk about my medieval card. Simple design, but I like it. There are several barrels with gold here. The card will be standing on the road, in this place. And it will be also burned. Something like this. Now it's time for a tutorial. I will show you how to build such a medieval card. Let's build this. for sum up this episode. As you can see, the mock is almost ready. I am still waiting for the construction of the tower and the addition of the last details. On my mock there will be 45 mini features in total. I think that's a lot. I think that you will see the final episode in September. Also, I have ideas for new projects. I will definitely come back to Star Wars. Write in the comment how do you like my project. If you have any ideas, let me know. That's it for me. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye.